So next, talking about collaboration and communication, Vault provides the ability to share data with the extended design team that might be outside of the realm of Vault. So we have the ability to integrate uh, and publish out to uh, Microsoft SharePoint server that uh, data that is ready for prime time, data that's ready for their eyes. So not everybody might have access or have the ability to log into Vault. There might be some people that are maybe um, slightly outside of the, the firewall or we want them to have restricted access to data. And SharePoint is a perfect tool for this. And this allows us to share information and allow that data, when it comes to a certain point, uh, to be published out to a predefined SharePoint uh, directory or SharePoint uh, folder series. And we can send out uh, the, the native files or a DWF or PDF, it basically upload the all the documents um, straight to a predefined repository on SharePoint. So following that theme of uh, the, the other people, so there's SharePoint, but, but who else? So there might be people that need to have data, but maybe they need more like bill of material and more up-to-date instant access instead of something that's published out. Vault Professional and Collaboration provide a lightweight web client that provides uh, search view print capabilities and even markup for a round trip. And the, the web client is nice because it's going to show data that is up to date. You're really looking at data inside of the Vault and your login and your credentials that you would have inside of Vault, uh, let's say the thick client or the full client, will be the same as inside of um, the Vault uh, web client. So it provides this lightweight viewing, the ability to navigate through folders, the ability to see the item master, uh, pull off a parts list if you need, uh, pull off a, a, a print, and maybe even update some of the, the drawing views. And this is going to be using DWF technology uh, on the back end, which allows us to mark it up. It allows us to take this and uh, uh, mark it up and you know possibly round trip it and the key here is it's secure, you know, so the, the ability to go in and look at what's inside a vault uh, without the ability to uh, check out or make any modification to it is nice for those downstream vault consumers, technicians, um, somebody that would just go to a, um, a kiosk perhaps and, and need that lightweight information.